Incoming transmission. Good work, Zulu Company. Apparently, Colonel Coter had this operation planned for some time. Base Ogre contained a mixture of Star League and Clan technologies. We now believe that there are several such bases surrounding a central facility. And that would be consistent with similar Star League outposts on the periphery. What that central facility does is anybody's guess. I'm transmitting orders for several sorties that will poke at the jag, 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 poke at in the last let's play that's okay we only have 25 minutes for this move all units to the extraction point destroy the Omnimex star destroy the bridge destroy the research complexes 25 minutes is a long time i feel like we'll definitely get this done but let's bring fast mechs welcome to episode two of our uh let's play of the mech commander expansion desperate measures desperate warriors um it's the full extended title in my mind. Today, uh, when last we met, we had salvaged a mad cat, a vulture. Did we get a vulture, actually? thought we did. I don't know. Maybe just a mad cat. Who cares? Anyway, it doesn't matter. We're doing great. All things are good. Yeah, there's a vulture. Um, life is good. So... Okay, we, we were starting to build up the mechs from the first Somerset Strikers, an awesome Amaler. We have a Centurion, we have a Bushwhacker. The other mech I couldn't think of, <laughs> excuse me, was a Wolfhound, which you only really see in a couple of episodes. Um, or else they give it to Kylie, the Aerojock who wants to be a mech warrior. And we all know she really kind of sucks. So you give her the crappy light mech, let her get blown up. I think they also gave it to Ciro, but he turned out to be a straight up traitor, so... Um, are there any mechs we want to buy? Fire starters, interestingly enough, I actually really like in normal battle tech because they can overheat the enemies. But in this, there's no heat, so they doesn't that whole mechanic is just missing. Ravens are also interesting. They're like this ECM, you know, electronic countermeasure unit. But uh, I don't know. I don't find there's any need for them in this like i don't frankly i don't want the enemy to not know where i am i want them to know so that they'll come hunt me so i can kill them so uh yeah anyway um all right let's figure out what we're doing here in terms of deployment so goblin and hitman these are these are going to be bros for life man they got the two omnimec jump jet mechs um and then on top of that we've got scarab and spice they're complementary they go in different uh, whatever groupings. Then we have Rooster. And then, if we're on a brief, a quick timeline, I don't know if I want to bring my awesome. As awesome as the awesome is, it may not be awesome on this level, if you know what I mean. Because the awesome is fairly slow. 18 meters per second. I mean, that's actually really, if, if somebody traveled 18 meters per second, that'd actually be really fast. What is that in kilometers per hour, I wonder? Um, oh, we can try out these shadow cats. 27? Okay, let's do some shadow cats. This is Gator. You got it. Gator and this gun. Is gunman. Yes, sir. Gator and gunman. We're all about speed on this one, folks. Guess pretty good. Are there any other mechs we don't have equipped? We have an Uller and a Raven J. That's okay. Oh, uh, and we do have some like clan tech. Let's actually so I mean the Shadow Cats are already pimped out with clan stuff, so we'll just leave them as is. Because it's sort of good enough. Um now the question is the Uller J. This one also has clan stuff, so I'll just leave it. Although it has a crappy inner sphere laser. Okay. We've got clan. E yeah, we've got like clan ER stuff. 
There's no point. Hmm. I need something that's gonna fit. Will something else fit on there? No. I don't know if I want to put too many missile racks on. One of the good things about the missile racks is they're slow firing, but if you're alpha striking down every mech, it really doesn't matter, you know? Um, okay, I guess we'll take off one of these. What kind of long range stuff can we add? Just one. Oh, that's literally it? Okay, that is a terrible deal. I don't know, I guess keep it on. Oh, here we go. Wait. Just an inferior version. The inner sphere stuff sucks. It weighs more. It's slower. Whatever. Just be slightly inefficient then. Who cares? Um, who else am I bringing? Oh, the bushwhacker. Oh, man. You are prime. Look at all this crappy inner sphere technology. I am so sorry, man. You're getting a little upgrade. Okay, so let's go with, uh, well, he had an LBX, so let's give him a clan LBX. Let's give him some clan long-range missiles, clan ER lasers, more clan, more clan stuff. 3.5 and 3. Alright, whatever, it's good enough. Fits with my MO of sort of long range missiles and uh, pulse lasers and stuff. Um, okay, I think that's pretty good. Alright, anyway. Uh, yeah, let's do this. Uh, scarab and spice and everything nice. Commencing deployment. Mech warriors, Mech prepare, warriors for combat. prepare for combat. Okay. Oh, and. Uh, sorry, I need to turn on my hotkeys. There we go. So, there we go. So, Mech Commander uses the arrow keys to scroll, or you can move your mouse to the edge of the screen. Moving your mouse to the edge of the screen is like an old school, like 90s way of scrolling. W, A, S, and D are how I want to scroll around in games these days. But I don't want to use the arrow keys. That just feels primitive. Also, I want to use the mouse wheel to scroll in and out, and I can't. Um, and so that also feels primitive. But, uh, okay, I'm going to send one group this way, one group this way, and we'll figure stuff out as we go. But we're going to have to split up on this one, boys, because we only got ten minutes. So, you know, get it done in ten. Okay, why are these guys not listening to me? They, like, decided selectively to not listen to my orders? What is happening here? Okay, there's a bunch of crap there. All right. Just run down here and jump into the base. Take it over. Inner sphere style, baby. You just got inner sphered. They're targeting me. I think I've got it. I guess we'll destroy them if we have to. There's no way through. Everyone, I run! Run! Take a shot. Oh my god. Sheriff here. There's a new sensor contact. They got me safe. Okay, we can repair okay, if we I'm kill on. everything, so if you guys can uh Kill everything, that'd be great. Take over the turrets, why don't you? Goblin here. They're shooting at me. I think the building is captured. Piece of cake. Alright, one down. There's a repair bay here, so we'll be fine. Goblin here, they're actually opening fire on me, sir. Another one. 
Why were those two guys just standing there instead of fighting? Yes, sir. Make a lot of sense, Shot but. Alright. Enemy mech destroyed. Hitman here. This building's captured. Okay, you guys go okay, repair I'm yourselves on. one at a time. Yeah, orders, Enemy Easily components gone, captured. Repair. This, is this building's captured. Reporting refit completed. Okay. Now, what is going on with these guys? Why didn't they actually you betcha, go when I? Yes, sir. Told them to go. I'm on it. And repair. Yeah, we got the building. Sir, I think my refit's complete. Okay, you repair you yourself. Contact. You betcha, sir. You are able to get over I'm here, you guys. Heads up, new contact. No. Okay, how about this? this? I've got a new contact. Torch the forest. Let's go through it. There you go. Hey, you found a path. Look at that, guys. I'm so proud of you. To do everything around here. The thing I don't like about repairing is you have to move your guys in and out of the building. It's rather tedious. Oh my god, it's a mad cat. <laughs> I wish I brought my mad cat. We could destroy the fuel canister, but it would destroy my precious mad cat potential to salvage it. Oh, jeez. Okay. There's actually a number of people there. Everyone run down this way. I'm bringing the reinforcements in. I'm taking hit. I'm on it. Take him down. Oh, a couple of PPCs coming in. Good thinking. I'm on it. I think we got one. I'm fight. Enemy mech destroyed. This is fight. I'm taking hit. Good Where's my backup, damn it? <laughs> Can't touch me. Yes, sir. Gunman here. I'm under attack. Did we get that mad cat? Yes! We got a second mad cat! Yes! Oh, that was so worth it. Mission objective complete. Goblin here. That one's history. See, we could have destroyed the fuel truck, but I think it would have like destroyed like fully destroyed the mechs. Um Okay, hold on. What was... Is the thing still blinking over there? Destroy... Bridge. Secondary incomplete. Oh, that bridge over there has to be destroyed. Okay. Well, how about you guys run over here? Because you need the repairs. And then you guys... will go over here. We'll figure this out together. Oh, there's a repair. Never mind. <laughs> Ah, uh, whatever. Yes, sir. It literally Structure takes too much here. time Building to repair captured. them. Enemy components okay, captured. Building captured. Sir, right. I can't get there from here. Everybody, run over this way, please. So now we just have to make sure we get out of this mission in time. <coughs> so yeah, I think this is the bridge. Destroy the bridge, destroy the research complexes, capture the processing plants. <laughs> I think that's the bridge we have to destroy. Let's get to destroy these things in case they're a thing. Target is this is gunman. Target is toast. Okay, you guys. Yes, sir. See if we can destroy yes, all sir. these forests. Okay, I'm we can on like it. get through this area, I think. There we go. Okay, so these guys. Well, we might as well cross the bridge before we destroy it. Peter here. I'm getting shot at. Yeah, there we, we got go. the building. All right. Building captured. I'm on it. So, can we just like nuke the bridge? 
I feel like that should be sufficient. And then we'll just sir, I can't head get this way. Here. Yes, sir. This hound has a fun. Mission objective complete. Okay, what do we got over here? All right, my dudes Could can take that, that down. Job. Couple of tanks. All right, so we're splitting our forces on this one. I might not need to, I, but I'm being like extra cautious because I really don't want to run out of time. Yes, watch it burn. Go, go, go. Oh, get the, me. get the turrets. Yes. Reporting building captured. Gunman here. I'm taking fire. Do what I can, sir. Vehicle Be cool to get a Thor as well, yeah, honestly. This is Gator. Yes, watch it burn. Hitman here. Popped me a mech, sir. Popped me a mech, sir. This town has a fox. Alright. No point in hanging around. Yeah, all right. Did we get a Thor? Oh, we did too. We <laughs> Let the good times roll, baby. Yes, sir. Let the good times roll. We should be playing Celebrate Good Times. Minus one enemy. Enemy components captured. Enemy vehicle I think there's a yeah, there's a knocked out bridge there, so we ain't going that way. All right. Wow. So far, this mission is a wild success. Oh, there's another research yes, facility sir. here. Uh oh, new sensor contact. We seem to have a new trace. Mission objective Target complete. Sherman. All right. We're like getting all these objectives, one after the other. All right, where are my dudes? Fall in line, folks. What other beautiful bounties can we get? That's oh, a hunchback. Like oh, <laughs> and he's Double just God. He's like, hey, I have an enemy contact here. Oh, God. Well, not anymore, they don't. Not anymore, they don't. Let's just check to make sure there's no more canisters that we're missing. Things look pretty good. What's this over here? Show me something special. Oh, I'm like just getting pegged here. All right, let's form up and we'll go in together. Get both the squads together here. That was, that was pretty successful splitting them up. Although truthfully, like Squad B didn't really do very much. It was like the main jump jump capable squad that did everything. I'll now be able to add a jump capable Thor though to the mix, which is nice. All right, boys. Everyone get over here. My only complaint with the jump jets is that the mechs don't use them automatically enough. Like there's no reason why um, they couldn't like the AI couldn't automatically jump over walls and stuff, but it's like it just chooses not to. It's actually quite annoying. Come on, you slow pokes. We're running out of time here. Only one part of the mission left. Get to the end. If I can't do this part, well, They're I'll be. Me. Say, I'll be very, very sad. Goblin here. Uh oh, new sensor contact. Can you just jump in there? Hurry. Got a new sensor Capture the building. Here. As quickly yes, as possible. I think the building is captured. Can't capture too many enemies. Goblin right. I didn't even get a chance to see what that mech was. It just yes, got sir. killed right away. I think the building is captured. And I think we just got it. Let's head to the base. Head to the exit. That's pretty much it. Yeah, I really didn't need the B team. They did very little. Somebody was shooting. Is there an enemy somewhere? Guess not. A sweet mad cat man. Come on, guys. 
Imagine you failed the mission right here because you took longer than 25 minutes. You guys are like right tra there trying to run mission to the exit. Mission objective complete. Mission successful. Mission successful. Let's look at our salvage. So we did everything, I think. All secondary missions, all everything. For low drop we were even under the drop weight. Scarab's veteran. All right. One, two, three shadow cats. Large lasers, LRM racks, a mad cat with another clan PPC, hunchback, Thor J, two, two more clan ER PPCs, clan heavy ultra auto cannons, a rail gun. Interesting. Well, I'm flush with cash. Or, sorry, reputation. It's not cash. Capture four of the seven salvage rigs. Capture six of the seven, seven of the seven. Star Captain Marcus Osis of the Smoke Jaguar has executed a surprise raid on our main supply depot, and his forces are fleeing north through Jade Sector with a large number of advanced weapon components. Your strike force will be dropped into the Jade Sector only minutes ahead of the enemy convoy. Captures many. Okay. Interesting. Is piloting his customized Masakari, so be prepared to use advanced weaponry. Interesting. That Novacat Omnimex are on the force are among the forces. Records indicate that these heavy class Omnimex are specialized short range fighters. Well, ain't that something? The thing is I don't care about any of that because I'm just gonna kill them all and take all their stuff. Cause that's how I do. All right, uh, I'm gonna take that out. I'm gonna strip the PPC off of this guy. I don't know if I'm ever gonna use that Centurion again. He's kind of been outclassed. Same with this Jaeger mech. I'm just gonna take off a few pieces of equipment I might want to use, even its sensors, frankly. You know what, whatever, I might actually sell that just to get out of my inventory. It's clogging up space. Um, okay, I've got a Thor, a Mad Cat, two Hunchbacks, three Hunchbacks. <laughs> got Shadow Cats. Okay, that Shadow Cat doesn't have anything on it, so we'll throw that out. Hunchback has nothing on it, so, well, we'll keep them because, uh, Clan chassis is usually better than the inner sphere chassis. Okay, this will repair this guy. And, uh, repair this guy. And we'll repair this guy. And I guess we'll refit all. Sure. Need some basic sensors. And. So let's put on more missile racks. Um, this guy is missing a lot of stuff, though. Okay. And in terms of mechs, I don't have any other. Oh, there's jump capable shadow cats. Oh, God. Okay. I understand. Um. I think the time has come to retire, Mr. Commando. And instead, a jump capable Shadow Cat interests me. All right. Pair of these guys. I'm just going to leave him for now. And, uh. Actually, I don't know about Shadow Cats because they are light armored units although so is the, the hunchbacks these are all light armored units okay hold on i want more heavily armored guys so hold on, let's take a look at our mission for a sec so first of all we do want our mad cat and our vulture j those goblin and hitman are like a team 
they just belong together. Next. Having a bunch of shadow cats might be good because they're pretty fast mechs. So maybe like a whole strike team of them. And I don't need to make them all jump capable, so... Um, yeah, because they're way faster than the Hunchback. Okay, let's just strip these Hunchbacks down a little. Oh, this is a moderately armored one. Okay, this lightly armored one I'm, I'm far less interested in. We'll take all of its equipment. I think you can... Just right click. Somebody told me you can right click and just totally strip a Mac. Like for instance, yeah, you can just like right click on stuff and it auto drops it. Okay, so that's interesting. Interesting way to strip a Mac. Um, okay, refit, refit. All right, so they got some room. First, they need some sensors. Next. I mean, Clan ER large lasers aren't terrible. But I also like Clan LRM racks. There we go. Um, there we go. Alright, so that's a missile based. Shadow cats. Oh, and these are jump capable too. That's beautiful. So, I don't know. We really actually should probably hire some better mech warriors, so. Who's skilled? Mantis reporting. As Mantis order, reporting. This is Dragon. Dragon reporting. This is Blaze. Blaze reporting. What about Ronin is as Ronin. well? Yes, sir. Alright. This is Baron. Mantis so let's this is drop Roger. some of these crappy dudes. Oh, so, okay, so we got two more shadow cats. So we have four shadow cats if we want. This is and uh, this let's is put in actually good people. Okay, so we're a shadow cat cruise, it turns out. I don't know how that happened. Are those all shadow cats? It's hard to tell actually from their little icons. Okay, four shadow cats. Two of these guys. I mean, I could just do this. Mission drop weight exceeded. Oh, that puts me over the limit. Even. Could just do Mission this. Oh, that exceeded. even that exceeds it. I only have seventy tons to play with. So I can put one Uller, and I guess I'll just throw another Uller in. Uh, there we go. This one here. Oh, he's our, he's got all his stuff. All right, so this is gunman. get in there, gunman. They call me the gunman. Oops. Uh, how do I return to the game? Uh, briefing deployment. The gunman. All right. Really, I'm going to separate group one and two immediately. These guys belong together, but these are like two separate groups. They're totally different speed classes. One deployed. can jump. Mech warriors prepare for combat. Doesn't make any sense to like leave them together. Um, so group New three. Selected. Oh. And I want one. New leader selected. There we go. All right. So the question is... This is an interesting mission because you can like see everything, but like where are they going to come from, I guess, is the main question. I don't know. I'm just going to kind of hang out here for a second until they show up. Capture four of the sal seven salvage rigs. What do these arrows do? And like, why... Why would you ever zoom in on the minimap and do this? <laughs> Just click and then you can see what's actually there. Okay. <clears throat> what I can, sir. No problem mad Cat all. J's, man. As ordered, sir. The best kind of Mad Cat. I've really like come to think the jump jet capable mechs in this game are some of the better ones. 
Just because it's like you can like hop into bases and stuff, and that turns out to be very handy. Wait, where are you guys going? Did they just turn tail and run? What is happening? Why did they flee? That was very weird. Okay. Where's my crew? <laughs> We're coming to kill you. It's like a big gang of okay, robots Goblin. coming for you. Ladies here, sir, I can't get through here. Take a shot. Thank Take him down. But just barely. Show me something special. Yes, sir. Goblin. Here. We salvage him? Damn it, we did not. As ordered, sir. Got my number. They're targeting me. No problem. <laughs> Can't touch me. No problem. This is gunman. That'll take care of him. As ordered, sir. Yes, sir. One. Enemy destroyed. Let's capture like these things. Ah, oh, we got them. Reporting vehicle captured. Okay, I'm on it. Reporting mech destroyed. Nope. Giving everyone different targets here. Yes, Enemy mech destroyed. Enemy destroyed. <laughs> the enemies are like, just nope. keep Enemy driving at them! Just, just keep driving! Don't captured. stop driving! Little crew members are trying yes, to run sir. away. You actually can gun those people down, but I feel too bad about it to do so. No problem. I'm on it. Nova Cats. Excellent, sir. I am under fire. This is Blaze. I'm under fire. Yes, sir. Looks okay. like I got it, sir. This is you guys want to capture these one. ones, or should I? Looks like the vehicle's captured. These are pretty easy missions, special. actually. Yes, sir. Skater here. I'm getting shot at. Okay, I'm on it. I would love to salvage that. Here. They're targeting me. Enemy mech destroyed. Mission Easily objective done, complete. Did I salvage it? I, I didn't even get to check. It. Well. I was expecting that to be a much more complicated mission than it was. It turns out they just drove straight at us, and it's all pretty basic. Alright, let's see what we got. I like how they were like, you're going to have to use extra special weaponry for this. I'm like, am I? All these T-bolts. We really should check those out. Oh, we got his Masakari! Damn, dude. Oh, man, that thing is a beast, though. Look at all... Holy shit! <laughs> Hold on a second. That thing is packing like 20 LRM racks. Oh my god. That is actually insane. I'll grant you. That 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 is a commander after my own heart. What did he rig this thing up with? Oh my god. A large X pulse right. Pulse laser. It does very little damage, but it fires like crazy. Huh, interesting. I kind of like this thing. I might just leave it as is. An 85 ton assault mech. It's pretty cool, actually. Um, and what is a Nova Cat? I can't even look at it. I don't like how you can't, like, get your units active. You know, like, okay. Guess let's just get rid of this thing. Here's my Nova Cat. What is it, even? Well, I forgot I had a Thor J that I, like, never <coughs> fixed up. I really should. Um, here are some basic sensors. Clan Goss Rifle, I guess. Oh. Actually, no. Clan ERPPC. And then, okay, so what is the long tom? 34 tons! 30! Oh, that's that railgun that the uh, guy was using on us on that weird mission. Interesting. Heavy Thunderbolt. 12 damage. 21 load value. Wow, some of these are crazy. That, th that thing actually has crazy damage. 12 damage for 6 shot For 6 seconds? What does this ERPPC do? It does more damage than a PPC and it's slightly faster. 
but it does take up more space, so forget it. Yeah, 21 versus 13, no way. Um, let's dump that. There we go. The, the thing that makes long-range weapons better than short, even if they're less efficient, is that you can fire them more frequently because you're more frequently in range. Where short range, they don't always get fired. So, in fact, actually, I'm not even, like, a real fan of these short-range weapons. Only 10 shots. Forget that, man. Um, like, I think the Clan Goss rifle is actually superior in that case. And then... There we go. So, yeah, like, this, I think, is a much better loadout. So, yeah, we gotta get somebody in this Thor J here. This is Ronin. Ronin. Um, repair. Kind of wish it just auto-repaired between missions, because there's really no point to having to manually repair these things. Because you're always going to do it. Um, I guess I'll repair this thing just for the heck of it. Might as well just strip it. All its parts. 70 ton clan mech. Hmm. I may use that eventually in the harder missions. I hope there are harder ones. The thing we found when we played the first mech warrior or mech commander is that I made it to the end and I didn't hit a point where um, I felt uh, overwhelmed or anything. You know, like we were comfortably um, annihilating the enemy and we didn't even have the heaviest mechs that we could field. So I'd love to do a mission at the very end where it's like, you know, Atlas versus Atlas, like a slug fest with like the heaviest mechs. But I don't know if this game is going to do that. We're not. Light Goss rifles. Interesting. PPCs. Hmm. Light auto cannons. Where's the ultra auto cannons? Like gauze rifle. Okay, anyway, it doesn't really matter. I don't know why I'm focusing on this. All right, what's our next mission here? Capture the base headquarters. Destroy Mog and targeting computer one. We only have 30 minutes for this. So relying on your strike force to eliminate all six mobile orbit, mobile orbital gun and targeting computer sites. Okay. Well, let's bring the A-team. Ronin, you are now joining. We have like a jump squad of clan mechs. It's slowly forming. I love it. Um, and then we have our shadow cats. They're the coolest cats in the inner sphere. Mission drop weight exceeded. Oh, is that all we can bring? That's probably fine. Yeah, I'm sure that's fine. Two of those shadow cats are jump capable. I guess I don't have another one. Eh? Uh, mix. I don't. But you know what I do have? I think one of these guys is jump capable. Yeah. So I'm gonna put you in instead. And that's fine. Now everyone's jump capable. Doot, doot, doot. Do I have a non-jump capable Mad Cat? I think I do. There's just no Mech Warrior in him. Like, don't have enough Mech Warriors. Let's purchase some new ones. Alright, Burnout. <laughs> do what I can, sir. This is Should call out. him Dropout. Whatever, he's on, the, he's on the team. You made it, buddy. Welcome to the big leagues. I wish I could bring you into combat. If you're not jump capable, so forget it. You'll see the next fight. All right, team. So you guys go here, and you guys go here. That's how we'll do. Oh, and instantly, the fact that we can just jump into this, this base rolling. matters. Raining bullets over here. Scare him here. There's a new sensor contact. Okay, capture the turrets. 
Oh god. Okay. And this is also why we jump. That we can jump out of trouble. Oh look, we got a repair bay even. Order acknowledged. Consider it done. And uh we can get repaired right away. I can't find a way through here. Order acknowledged. Okay, let's double Arab, check if we can capture tourists over here. Yeah, there, there's one Thor down. Pretty sure we annihilated him so bad there could be any salvage from that guy. Yeah, still no salvage. Goblin here. Enemy mech destroyed. Alright, we got Goblin here. I think the building is captured. Got those. Alright. Yes, Order acknowledged. Target eliminated. Mission objective. Target is destroyed. Alright, one down. There's something over here though that's blinking. Oh, sensor control. Go ahead and take that. Is anyone injured? You. So be it. Repair yourself. Consider it done. Building oh, look at that. Mission now we can like see Building everything. Omnimech hangar. Repair. I read it. Things complete. Alright, let's stay together because splitting up seems like a really bad idea there. Uh for this. We'll just double strike this thing. This is Ronin. I'm taking incoming fire. Seven, six. <laughs> and down they go. All right, we'll just use one more strike here. This guy's like, what the hell just happened? I guess they told me just to keep this place safe and oh God. <laughs> All right, that one was easy. All right, who's guarding this? When you can't capture stuff, it's because there's a bad guy too close. Harassing fire. Harassing fire. Hitman here, Randy Bullock over here. It's like the set. The towers are not willing to like surrender to you. If their bosses are around. But as soon as the boss isn't around, they're like, "You want to surrender? We surrender." Looks like I got it, sir. We completely surrender. Get on, sir. <coughs> we don't want no trouble. Sorry, I can't do that. Mission Yes, sir. All right. Well, there's another shadow cat. Down he goes. Enemy destroyed. Oh, we actually got another Thor. That's pretty good. I think I really like the Thor and the Loki mechs as a chassis, but I really don't like the clan loadouts on them. It's like I prefer a different loadout, frankly. Um, Alright, so we need to go over this way first. Just moving in a crew, clearing the map. With my giant robots. Apparently this game has multiplayer. I have never played it before in my life. And I would be curious to try and also, I don't know how much I would enjoy it, honestly. You know what I, I only played a little bit of, but actually I did enjoy was um, the Harebrained Studios Battletech game that came out uh, several years back now. That does have multiplayer, and I had a friend who, um, who was into it as well, and we tried multiplayer a few times. It was actually quite fun. Um, I had... Um, by the time we played multiplayer, I'd figured out the cheese where if you took fire starters and you reserve their turn to the very end of a turn cycle, you could jump jet in behind an enemy assault mech. You Get could alpha there. strike it right contact. in its back with flamers and machine guns and usually like detonate its, you know, uh, ammo slash, uh, uh, you know, all the other like mayhem that comes from like an alpha shotted back shot. Oh, a bunch of guys just Goblin fell. Here. I think I have a new contact. Um, 
And yeah, so we played one match, and I totally surprised him with that move, and he was like, oh my god! Uh, but then after that, kind of the jig was up, and then he started using light mechs and stuff, but he'd never seen it before in his time playing the game. He never thought to try it, but... It was a pretty fun one match where I was able to surprise the heck out of him. Well, let's go for this guy. I don't know if it's better to take out the weaker mechs or the bigger mechs first, but... I guess I figure the bigger mechs can go down pretty fast, and then... They have most of the weaponry, so... Alright, now this one... Take that cougar down. I actually like the cougar as well. I, uh... Oh, yeah, we got one. I was gonna say, I, I quite enjoyed playing with cougars in the, uh, the last... In the non-expansion Let's Play that we did. Mission objective there you go. Damn it, I'm out of ammo. Out of ammo. Well, that's foolish. I don't think it'll matter, though. Pretty sure we got this. Although my, uh... Vulture is pretty low there. I always thought this music sounded sort of like Scottish. Like bagpipes and stuff. And I was never quite sure if it really fit in the Battletech universe. What is happening? I have turrets fighting off two shadow cats very gradually. <laughs> Want to come kill me? It's funny. Oh, a couple of random vehicles. Yes, sir. This is Garib. There's a new sensor contact. This is Mantis. I am under enemy fire. I'm under enemy okay, fire. There's a random jeep. Shooting a few periodic yes, missiles my way. I'm in a mech. I'm terrified. Yes, Goblin here. Looks like I got it, sir. <clears throat> hey. Reporting vehicle destroyed. Guardhouse, watchtower. If I was in these barracks, I would just close the door and hope they don't notice I'm in here. <laughs> Frankly. Well, there's a vulture. Cool. Hope we can salvage him. We'll come around this way, I think. My tactic is bum rush him. <laughs> I feel like better commanders would be like, "Well, I'll we'll send in the light units to distract him, and then come in with the heavies and hit his rear armor and stuff." And I'm like, "Forget that, bum rush! Get him, boys!" Okay, I'm on it. I'm registering a new contact. Like, look at that. I think he just this fell over. Uh-oh, new sensor <laughs> contact. <laughs> he's like, what is happening? And he's down. Enemy Shit, and he's gone. Here. I wonder if they actually lost. add every mech instantly to the salvage, and then there's some kind of probability roll that they don't end up. Because I feel like I, I'm off of the extreme PPCs, and I'm not, like, overkilling mechs by that much, but maybe it's, like, very fragile. Maybe after a mech goes down, like, if it gets hit with almost anything, then you lose it as salvage. I don't know. Another Loki would have been... Or, yeah, was it Loki? No, not a Loki. A uh, Vulture. Another Vulture would have been nice, but it's not essential. Fun fact, the Vulture is called the Mad Dog in clan vernacular, and the Mad Cat is called the Timberwolf. So... Close. The inner sphere called the Mad Cat the Mad Cat, but clan's called the Timberwolf. But the Mad Dog is a mech, and it kind of looks like the Mad Cat, but it's the Vulture. Uh, anyway. Just a bit of a uh, fun fact. Because, I mean, if you don't know Battle like so basically when the clans invaded, they were a mysterious force, and the inner sphere had never encountered them before, so they didn't know what the they called their mechs. So the inner sphere made up a whole set of names for the clan mechs they saw and then the clans internally have a whole different set of names so kind of interesting how the clan mechs have double names I think I tend to call the clan mechs by the inner sphere names but uh, the clans do not obviously um, alright now yeah, what did we get oh we got a cougar Ooh, repair this guy too and we got a Thor. Oh, god damn it. 
<laughs> I guess as cool as this atlas is, like, there's just literally... And same with the Marauder. Or Ma Marauder Mauler. I wish there was a Marauder in this game. Fun fact, the Marauder plus the Catapults equals Mad Cat. Marauder, Catapults. When the Inner Sphere first encountered the Marauder, I've said this so many times, but the targeting computers couldn't decide if it was a Marauder or a Catapult, and so it kept cycling back and forth between Mad and Cat, which are the call signs for Marauder and Catapult, so they called it a Mad Cat. Um, and that's how you know you've read the... Uh, that's how you know you've read the novels. I used to read the Battletech novels when I was a kid because I was super cool. Actually, I actually have so many fun. I I have all the Battletech novels downloaded. Like I found them years later in um, like PDF form and stuff. And I started to reread uh, Lethal Heritage. It's the one that stars starts with uh, Phelan or Phelan Kell son of Morgan Kell of the Kell Hounds and he gets captured. He's one of the first uh, you know, inner sphere people captured by uh, the clans and he he ends up rising through the ranks of Clan Wolf. Um, but um, yeah, and it has like Takashi Kurita and it deals with like the defense of Luthien against the clans and the Battle of Wolcott and like it's a whole clan invasion and those books I used to stay up late at night in my room because I used to have to go to bed at like some ridiculous time, like whatever it was, nine or ten. But then I was allowed to stay up if I read. And I was like, oh, my God, I found a loophole. I can read about robots. So <laughs> I thought I was getting one past my parents. I just sit and like read to like one in the morning reading about all this battle tech stuff. And it was like so comforting and so cool. Like I just I loved it. Um and I started rereading the books when I did get them. And I did find them interesting, but I guess I just don't have as much time as I used to to, like, really dive into it. So it's like I, I, I didn't, like, keep up with it. So I didn't even read the full first book. But I would like to again. It's not for disinterest that I haven't done it. It's just hard to find the time. Um, anyway, okay, those mechs, whatever. Let's check our mission first. We may not even have space for them. Um, okay. So we're just full-on raiding one base here by the looks of it. Star Captain Ratburn is quartered in the clan headquarters along the east side of the base and has valuable data regarding Jaguar troop movements. Okay. Star Captain Kulin Limbo is sure to be guarded and may attempt to flee behind enemy lines as soon as any of the units begin fighting. Uh, is not essential to the mission. Recon reports that the area contains Starly Command. Okay. So we need to hunt him down. Capture the APC. Capture this. Okay, so we want fast forces like we always do. Um, okay. Madcat J. Check. Thor J. Check. Vulture J. Check. Cougar J, you might want to join the team here. Okay, who else is a J? Okay, we got two Shadowcat Js. And then... Okay, I think we do want to bring this Cougar in. Okay, you know what? This guy... You're off the team. Um... And Uller J. <coughs> Uller J can go there. Okay. I mean, I do have room for just a random non jump capable Mad Cats. Let's see. I haven't brought any heavy mechs in because I just, like, literally don't have, like, the capacity to. There's just so many other mechs that need to go into the mix. Um, okay. You are not jump capable. You're a good mech, but you're just not jump capable. So I'm actually going to pull you out of rotation. You know, trying to assign your components to somebody more capable. Um, yeah, let's get this heavy flamer. That's what I was like, why is this mech not yielding enough weaponry? And it's like, it's got, because it's got a stupid heavy flamer on it. Okay, let's do this and this, and I 
guess we'll just give it intermediate sensors and be done with it. All right, there's a Cougar J. Ready for rooster. rooster. Oh wait, we have a veteran now. Rooster. rooster, we want you back, buddy. We're sorry about all those things we said about you. He's like, you said things about me? <laughs> uh, no. I mean, <clears throat> no. Um, and then I guess we could just have like two fast necks. Yeah, that sort of makes a team. These guys are not jump capable, but they may not need to be. We got burnout here. You know who this guy looks like? Have you guys seen The Righteous Gemstones? It's an HBO show with John Goodman and uh, Danny McBride, Adam Devine. It's a hilarious show. Um, he looks like the stuntman from the first season who... I won't say any more, but he is involved against the gemstones. So, anyway, Commencing deployment. let's do this. Mech warriors prepare for combat. All right. So, oops. All right, everybody, stay in formation. Keep it tight. We got word that the uh, Star Commander is gonna try and flee. I want you to hunt that scumbag down to the ends of the earth. Ain't no jags getting past us. I don't know why I'm talking like this, but... It's my no-nonsense commander voice. Oh my. Rooster here. Hey, I got a contact. Do ya, Rooster. I have a new sensor contact. Do ya? This is Greg. I have a new contact. Oh, well, this is somebody this fast. Is we to have a new and he's down. The enemy is engaging me. <laughs> Definitely didn't get any salvage out of that. <laughs> contact. Yes, sir. Rooster here has got me paid. Enemy mech oh. destroyed. Are there people behind us? Hey, I got a contact. Yeah, I'm just gonna let them choose their own targets and hopefully they won't overkill like I always do. This is Goblin. Enemy mech destroyed. When I when I tell them to alpha strike, they all just overkill everything. All right, nobody got past us. That's good. My guys know what's up. They've done this enough. The enemy has Get in there. They got me pegged. Rolling Get in there. The enemy is engaging me. I'm getting shot at. Rooster here. I got a new sensor trait. Get in there. I'm under fire. Here up here. I am receiving direct fire. Okay, where? Where are the turret controls, damn it? Oh, they're over here. over here. Get it. Okay, we got one. We got the building. Got the beat. Roger that. Get on in there. Uh-oh. Okay, they are gonna start fleeing soon. Yeah, this is kinda chaos. I think the building is captured. You guys should be trying to destroy this game. <laughs> Oh, there he goes. I think. Okay, jump in there. Capture this stuff. Gate control. Order okay, the guys on the outside over here literally didn't even move this whole time. Okay. Jump. Somebody jump in here. Oh god. Mission objective. This is okay, no. Oh no, the guy got away. Enemy vehicle destroyed. 
Dragon reporting. Next I thought we were like on top of it, but I guess he like really bailed. I thought he was in this thing. Oh well, it's okay. These guys didn't even make it in. <laughs> That's embarrassing. Let's go kill this thing over here just in case we can salvage it. Ooh, another mad cat. We are mad for mad cats. Well, you know what? We didn't have a perfect mission again. I guess it's okay to have one or two missions like that. All right, he's done. Where is he? I'm out of ammo. Yeah, there he goes. Did we salvage him? No, we didn't. <laughs> Just flopping around. Alright, well, eh, we did pretty good. It was secondary stuff. I really should have paid more attention to the radar. What is this icon? This sort of... Looks like a balloon. The balloon is flashing. <laughs> I am receiving directed fire. Uh, you are? From who? Oh god. Guess we didn't capture I'm getting shot at. That one. This is Ronan. I'm taking incoming fire. Well, just don't walk near the turrets. They're still hostile towards us. It's raining bullets over here. Well, guys, I don't know what to tell you. Why are you still doing it? <laughs> they disobey my direct orders, man. Oh, there's even a repair this shop over there. Under enemy fire. Uh, return to the extraction point. It's interesting how there's like a repair bay because like under what scenario would you be like repairing yourself? Like we're done. <laughs> we did it. We're out. Mission accomplished. There's also a lot of like bottomless pits hanging around this planet. <clears throat> Isn't this planet called Cermak or something? Sarek? The original planet in Mech Commander is Port Arthur. Mission objective complete. Mission successful. successful. So we lost 15,000 reputation points. But we got a Mad Cat W, which I think is even better. That is... Can't put a price Incoming on that. Oh, here we go. <laughs> Sir, I think there's something wrong with my view screen. The capture of the clan commanders has unearthed disturbing information. The clan forces on Cermak have located ancient Star League nuclear weapon facilities. Oh, that's not good. Word of this threat immediately transmitted to clan commander. Okay. Recon reports Turkin, Turkina class. I haven't heard of those before. All right, let's do one more mission together and then I think we'll call it for today. So let's repair all of our mechs. And... Repair these guys up. Repair. And what new mechs do we have? We have a Mad Cat W. I will always power up another Mad Cat if I can. So we're short one ERPPC. And sensors. There we go. Close enough. Um, in fact, I'd rather have that, frankly. Um, okay. Briefing. Capture the sensor control. Capture the hyperpulse generator stations and defend the base. Ooh, that's fun. This is a base defense. Okay. In fact, this... I mean, it is good to still have jump-capable mechs, but here now, having non-jump-capable mechs is probably fine, too. On a defense mission. And if it is a defense mission, I don't know if I want my speed group. What's my tonnage? 400? Okay, let's just see how this works out here. Um... Bring in my shadow cat. Mission drop weight exceeded. Oh, we're over already. Okay, never mind. That guy. Oh no, he's not jump capable. You're jump capable. Um, 75 more tons. Is there some other? Oh, we could bring another. Uh, 
Thunder here. Mad Cat. We're recovering the Mad Cat crew. And frankly, I'm okay with it. Burnout and Thunder. Commencing deployment. Mech warriors prepare for combat. All right. It'd be cool to mount. It'd be cool to uh, have like just nothing but Mad Cats. Some might say boring, but I say never. You can never have too many Mad Cats. Burn out here. Under attack. Burn out here. Enemy vehicle. All right, guys. Goblin here. Uh -oh. Jump your way in and. This is Goblin. They're targeting me. One if you can. I've got it framed. Vehicle destroyed. I want to capture this thing. Already taken care of. Son of a bitch. Yes, sir. Thunder here. I am under fire. Why can't I capture They're these? Targeting me. Hitman, about me and Max, sir. This guy? Yes, sir. You better not be these random fuel trucks. This is Hitman. It's raining bullets over here. This is her now. That took care of him. Reporting vehicle destroyed. Oh, there was like an LRM carrier. Rolling gear, reporting vehicle destroyed. Order acknowledged. There we go. Dragon report, vehicle destroyed. Building captured. All right, guys, come on in. Sorry Building about that. Captured. If you destroy these fuel trucks, they will totally explode. <clears throat> well, we got a little more beat up there than I anticipated, but that's okay. <coughs> I'm sure it'll be fine. Okay, I'm on it. Ooh, components. Enemy components yes, captured. This building Enemy captured. Enemy components captured. Dragon report. Building All captured. Right, we got those. Okay, I'm what on were it. they? Ooh, ERPPCs. Yeah. Yeah, baby. <coughs> Just double checking there's nothing over here, too. All right. This way. Burn out here. I can't get through here. Ugh, I don't know how, how, like how if you click like really far in the distance, they don't know how to go. You really do have to like micromanage these guys. It's like taking a bunch of toddlers to the museum. I have a new contact. The enemy has me raised. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Yeah, the question is where is the this control is like I got it, sir. Tower, and we got it. Enemy components captured. The thing is, like, capturing the enemy turret towers, it's not even like a thing where I'm like, oh, I want to be super efficient. It's like, literally, it takes more bullets, time, and health to kill the turrets than to just take them over. So it is just way more efficient to just always capture them. Shooting them down is just a big pain. This is Dragon. I have a new contact. This is Goblin. Oh, yeah. I think I have a new contact. This is Goblin. Sir, I can't get there from here. Goblin here. They're targeting me. Piece of cake. This is Burnout. I think I got him. Okay, I'm on it. Get over there. Bullets over here. I can't do that, sir. I think the building is captured. All right, all the turrets are neutralized. Yes, sir. It's like you just walk up to the building in a mech and you, like, aim your arm at the like command deck window and everyone inside is like oh we get it i forgot we're on your side now and you're like damn right you are you're like, don't make me come back here i will kill you all and everyone inside is like well we belong to the inner sphere now i guess you are working for house davian but you're blue which would i would assume you were steiner but although i guess you're blue and gold which at this point in the inner sphere history, they Steiner and uh, uh, Davian have allied to the Federated Commonwealth, so they've merged. Which I always wish that would have lasted, but it in the eventually they split back up. I remember reading the books about like you know when they first merged, then when they split up, and yeah, like speaking of the books, oh that's way that's too much. Guys, that was too much firepower there. Yes, sir. Ronan here. I have a new contact. I'm reporting a new sensor track. Hitman here. Target terminated. Yes, sir. This is thunder. It's rubble. Oh my God. I'll take care of it. Burnout here. Target trash. 
Okay, Look at all these perimeter time. alarms. Roger that. This is Burnout. I have a new contact. Target trash. Okay, got it. Ronin here. Target there we go. Okay, Swiping them all out. I'm taking enemy fire. This is Burnout. Target trash. Yes, sir. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Okay, got it. Okay, got it. This is Burnout. It's got there we go. Yes, sir. Eagle oh, a bunch of hunchbacks. A bunch of unattractive mechs are showing up. Get them, boys! Don't look them in the face. Out of ammo. Okay, I'm on it. Goblin here. That one's history. Okay, got it. Time to die. Time to die. I can't get through here. Wagon reporting. Target destroyed. That should be enough for the okay, perimeter alarms. Enemy vehicle destroyed. Target eliminated. Okay, got it. <clears throat> okay. <laughs> Jump. I think I got him, sir. Okay. It's raining bullets over here. Jump, you guys. Got to get a couple of you guys in there. Wait, who's getting shot at and from what? Okay, you know what? Here, Here's a tip, guys. If somebody's shooting you in the back, feel free to take some initiative and shoot back. <laughs> Why am I micromanaging that? Okay, here's the Mad Cat J. And then the other two Mad Cats who can't jump. We'll call them the NJs. Alright, here's our... Infiltration crew. Capture some components. Enemy components captured. Okay, we're also going to Okay, I'm on it. Prepare our dude up. Roger that. Jump in here. My reaping is complete. Order acknowledged. Dragon report. Building captured. Okay, I'm gonna start the repair process because it's so tedious to get all these guys repaired. Yes, Easily done, sir. We've got the building. Here we got you. Okay, I think. Sir, I think my we got everything. Okay, you guys get over here. You repair. Easily done, sir. Alright, we do seem to have control of the building, which is good. Repair complete. <clears throat> Repair yourself. Well, here come some enemies. Repair complete. And you. Alright, what are we facing off against? <laughs> a vulture and two confused vehicles. Too worried about that. Hey, what was this over here? We something we didn't do. Capture the sensor control tower. Wait, what? It's like something over here that's blinking. Turret control. I see nothing. Is there a sensor control tower I'm not noticing? What is that thing? Already taken care of. Wait, hold on. I didn't mean to attack it. I was trying to click on it just to see what it was. <clears throat> Capture the hyperpulse generator stations. What do those even look like? Oh! They're right over here. I can't get through here. Okay, you capture that one. You capture that one. And you capture that one. Already taken care of. Building. Building captured. Did we get them all? I still don't know what I'm supposed to do over here. Mission objective complete. It's like, capture the sensor tower. What sensor tower? 
the absolutely nothing. Watchtower. Hmm. Okay, let's uh everybody get out of the base here. Whatever the hell that thing is, we're gonna have to kill it on en route. Salvage rigs. No. I was like, maybe I'm supposed to capture those? But I don't think so. Okay, let's ambush these guys, this convoy over here. Nice old-fashioned ambush. Why are they pre-damaged? You call yourself clanners? Yes, sir. All right, take him down. He's big. This is it, man. Pop me a mech, sir. Goblin here. They're shooting at me. Drone in here. Enemy vehicle destroyed. This is Thunder. I am under fire. Burn out here. I think I got him. Oh, what did he get hit with? Vehicle oh, my God. Enemy vehicle oh, my God. Destroyed. Oh, those are, like, crazy powerful turrets. All right, we don't have to do anything. He's done. Okay, I want to... Here, um, you guys become group you three and you run down here and investigate this. I don't know what that guy's doing. What is this thing over here? Oh my God. Oh, holy sh shite. Look at all this stuff over here. All right, well. I'll just kind of leave two guys behind and everyone else is going to get stuff. Look at all these cargo containers down here. Oh my God. Look at all this stuff. <laughs> Capture the sensor control tower. What sensor control tower? <laughs> what bloody tower? I swear, am I blind? Oh, it's right there. It's right there. Okay. Well. I will do that. But before I do that, I want to hop in this crazy base and steal everything they got. So give me a second here. Bear with me. Meanwhile. Roger that. Also, what do these salvage rigs actually do? Oh man, there's so much stuff. Oh, we got we got that Turica, whatever it was. Huh. Yeah, I don't want to actually act, capture the sensor station in case it activates the next part of the mission. Well, <laughs> my guys are like way on the ass end of the map over here. Oh my god, they had to run so far. It's unbelievable. These are pretty big maps, actually. Okay, I think one this one guy here can do it. Yep, for the challenge, Hitman. Run in there. Take over the turrets before they kill you. It's raining bullets over here. And, uh... Don't fall. If you could run, that'd be good. Easily done, sir. Hitman here. This building's captured. They're targeting me. This is Goblin. Sir, I can't get there from here. This building's captured. I like how he's still destroying the turret out of vengeance, even though the turret, like, agreed to be on our side. Oh, baby. It's like the mother load right here. Enemy components captured. captured. This building's captured. Enemy components Hitman. captured. Enemy building's captured. Enemy captured. Enemy captured. Enemy captured. This building's captured. 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 Enemy components. Enemy Goblin components. Here. I think captured. the building is captured. Enemy components. I think the captured. building is captured. Hitman here. This en building's enemy captured. Enemy components captured. Goblin. Enemy components <laughs> captured. <laughs> I think the building is captured. Enemy components. Hey, did we captured. miss any? Captured. Piece of cake. Is that it? I mean, not that I feel like I deserve any more, but. Um, all right. Well, you run back over here. You guys. Kind of grateful I missed this thing initially. 
I probably would have missed that. Like, what did I get from all that? Gauze rifles, flamers, sensors, ERPPCs, like literally a little Mission bit of everything. Mission oh, that's it. <laughs> oh, I thought they were going to actually attack me. Turns out, no. They were just all talk. Clans are all talk, guys. A 95 ton salt mech. Thing is pretty crazy. I'm just gonna strip it. I just don't have the capacity to bring mechs this big into combat. Anyway, we are flush with clan technology. Next time, we will go through and we're gonna like ramp things up to the extreme, I think. Um, by upgrading all the tech we can on our mechs. I mean, it's not like our mechs don't have tons of clan tech, but we'll try and get even more. Guys, I hope you've enjoyed this second episode of our uh, Mech Commander Desperate Engagements Honorable Combat Expansion. I think it's called Desperate Measures, actually, if I'm remembering correctly. Um, if you have enjoyed the video, don't forget to like the video, share it with all your friends and family and the bondsmen in your service. And, uh... Oh, look at this one. 70 tons. This is interesting. Going to be a very different mission next time. Guys, I hope you will tune in next time. Until next time, you all take care of yourselves. And uh, if you want to see the exciting conclusion and possibly multiple extra videos, because I don't know if it'll all be concluded in the next video, you have to come back. So uh, until then, my friends, no guts, no galaxy. We'll see you next time. Peace.